Hi there folks and welcome to Get Strumming. Now today I've had a special song request from subscriber John Berger. Thanks John. John's always suggesting really good songs for this channel so it's really appreciated. So John has asked me to do a tutorial for the Beatles Here Comes the Sun but an easy version, an easy strumming version which is a great idea. Um, a lot of you will be familiar to this kind of thing. Now obviously that uh, runs along with uh, what the Beatles actually played, what George Harrison played on his acoustic guitar. However, we're not going to do any of the finger picking, we're just going to concentrate entirely on the chords. So the good news is I'm going to show you uh, in the key that the Beatles played how to play the song which is A major. So first of all I'm going to show you how to play these different chords because I know that there's a lot of beginners to this channel and they're probably thinking oh how do you play an A chord or how do you play a B7. So here goes. So to begin with we're going to start off with an A major. So all you need are your first and second fingers for this chord. So your first finger goes on the first fret third string and your second finger goes on the second fret fourth string which is the string that's closer to your face. So that is an A major. Next up, we're going to be using a D major. So you're going to be using your first, second and third fingers. So you use your first finger on the second fret fourth string, second finger, second fret third string, third finger, second fret second string. Next up, we've got an E7. So again, using your first three fingers. First finger goes on the first fret fourth string, second finger, second fret third string, third finger, second fret, first string. Next up we've got a B7. Now there's a couple of ways you can play a B7. You can either play it as a bar chord or as a three finger chord. I would suggest maybe to beginners who find it a little bit difficult pressing down to get a bar chord to use the three finger version. But I'll, I'll show you both versions of B7. The bar chord version using your first finger and you kind of pressing down on the whole uh, second fret across all four strings and then your second finger goes on the third fret third string. So that's the bar chord version of B7 but it can be a little bit tricky especially if you're a beginner. Notice how I'm really pressing down with my thumb on the back of the neck. Now the, the uh, three finger version of B7 goes like this. You use your first finger on the second fret second string, second finger third fret third string, third finger fourth fret fourth string. I always think that's a slightly easier way of playing B7. Next up we've got a C major, nice easy chord. So you're going to be using your third finger on the third fret first string. Next up we've got a G major. So again you're using your first, second and third fingers. First finger goes on the second fret third string, second finger second fret first string, third finger third fret second string. Okay then. Now, the strumming for this song we're going to keep really simple because um, we could do a bit of up and down strokes but I just want to show you how to keep it really simple. So we're just going to be doing down strokes for this song. Okay then, so to start off with the, in instru uh, the introduction, sorry, we're going to start off with um, the A major chord and it starts off like this. And then to a D. E7 Then back to the A Then to a D And then E7 And then we're going to start off back on the A Here comes the sun Then to the D Here comes the And then to the B7 so did I say Then back to the A It's alright Now we're going to do a bit of to and fro Between the D A D A Then two uh, strokes on the E7 bum, bum. So I'll just do that again D A D A E7 E7 And then we're into the first verse Which goes like this Start on the A Little darling, it's been a... Then to the D, long, cold, lonely. Then 
going to E7. Winter. Then back to the A. Little darling, it seems like. Then to the D. Years since it's been. Then E7. Clear. And then back to the A. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Then to the D. Here comes the B7. Sun, I say. Then back to the A. It's alright. Then to the D. Da, da, da. A. Da, da, da. D. Da, da, da. A. Da, da, da. And then E7. Da, 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 da. Then back to the A. Da, 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 da. And then E7. Da, 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 da. Then we're going to go back to the A for the second verse. Little darling, the smiles re, and then to D, turning to the E7, faces, and then back to the A. Little darling, it seems like to D, years since it's been E7 here. And then back to the A, here comes the sun, do do do, do. then to D. Here comes the B7, sun, I say, back to the A, it's all right. Then to D, da da da, A, da da da, T, D, da da da, A, da da da, E7, da 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 da, A, da 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 da, two strums on the E7, bam, bam, ba da da. Now for this bit, I've said that we're not going to do any finger picking, but there's just a little bit here that you might want to learn. It's, it goes like this. So it's not too tricky. What you do is you start off with the open second string, um, the E string. Then you, you play the fourth fret second string. And then the second fret first string. Just like that, and it just leads in to the uh, sun, 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 and then we're going to go to the C, sun, G, sun, D, sun, hear it, and then back to the A, comes E7, E7, and then do your little riff, oops, I'll do that right, and then back to the C, sun, G, sun, D, sun, Hear it, A, comes, two, three, four, E7, E7, little riff again, then back to the C, song, G, song, D, song, hear it, back to the A, comes, two, three, four, E7, E7, little riff again, then C, song, G, song, D, song, hear it, four times on A again, Two stabs on E7, and one more time, little riff, then C, song, D, song, um, C, G, D, hear it, A comes. And now we're going to go to the E7. And then we're going straight back into the third verse. So we start. Yet again, back to the A major. Little darling, I feel that to the D, I see slowly E7 melting. And then back to the A. Little darling, it feels like D, D. Years since it's been E7 here. Then back to the A. Here comes the sun, do 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 to the D. Here comes the B7, sun, I say, back to A. It's all right, then D, A, D, A, E7, E7, back to the A. Here comes the sun, do 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 to D. Here comes the B7, sun, I say, back to A. It's all right. D, A, D, A, E7, E7, A. It's all right. D, A, 
D, A, E7, E7, C, G, D, pause, D, D, back to A, comes. And that is essentially how to play the easy version of Here Comes the Sun. Now, some of you might be watching this, especially if you're beginners, and you might be thinking, Dom, you're going way too quick for me. I can't understand this. It's going way too fast. Right. There's a really good function that YouTube has. If you look to the top right hand side of this video, you will see three vertical dots. Press on those dots and it will take you to a playback menu. Press, press on playback function and then playback speed. So there are two um, increments you've got to go to. Um, playback function, playback speed and go to 0 0.75 and that will slow the video down just enough for you to be able to keep up with what I'm doing because I do realise sometimes I might be going a little bit fast uh, for various players out there. If we were having a one-to-one -one, obviously I'd be able to slow down but as it is um, I can't do that so you can slow this video down for your own delight. So it's the three buttons on the top right hand side of the video, press on those, go to back to playback menu, playback function and then uh, playback speed 0 0.75. Okay now I've been through the song so what we're going to do now is play the song together. See if you can manage. Okay then. So don't forget we're going to start on A. Da -da -da -da.
so there you go so it's something like that anyway so that's the uh, thank you hey we've got an audience here as well how about that well thanks very much for joining me everybody and uh, good luck with that and i'll catch you for more get strumming tutorials in the future cheers folks